Hi, this is the Essence of Life, and this reading is for all Libras in the universe, sun, moon, and rising. Messages may or may not resonate, as this is a general reading, but if it does, please like, share, and subscribe, and thank you for watching. So we're going to dive straight in. I've already pre-shuffled your cards. So we're just going to see, do a quick free spread, free card spread on the energies between you and your person. And let's dive straight in. We've got the world card in your energy. Six of cups, your person's energy. Someone's feeling very nostalgic nostalgic and the moon card and the energy of your relationship with this person this connection here okay so the world card new cycle beginning or a cycle has ended there's an accomplishment here or something that wants to start over the energy of six of cups so this person is connected to you spiritually this is probably your soulmate this is like a past life connection you you and this person's got history together definitely and it looks like they're in their head about you libras clarify the world card thank you my angels Thank you, spirit guys, ancestors of the highest white light. Give us this insight into the world card. Thank you for the insight and the clarity. Okay. So we have the Queen of Wands and the Seven of Cups. Oh. Wow, Libras, you're in this fire energy. Wow, Queen of Wands. Yeah, this is a very passionate feminine, yeah? She looks good. She takes care of herself. And she is admired by many. She's so attractive, yeah? And she attracts to her a life of abundance, prosperity, you know, she manifests and she's in this energy of the Seven of Cups, options, choices. Yeah, so if this is you, Libra, you've got options. You're exploring your options, new beginnings. Wow, the cycle's turning, changing for you. You're in the new cycle now where you're exploring your options. Being that Queen of Wands energy, being that social butterfly, beautiful. Okay, Libra. What's the Six of Cups energy? Six of Cups. Six of Cups is clarified with the Six of Pentacles, the Fool and two of wands came out as well okay so your person who wants to take that leap of faith towards you because look we've got the six of pentacles this represents balance yeah giving and receiving so this person wants to bring balance to this connection it looks like they want to give to you they're in this energy of giving so it goes to show uh, in this Six of Cups connection here, it was probably one-sided for a very long time. There was, so there was no balance. This person needed to bring that balance and now they're in that energy to do so. They want to take that leap of faith and bring in that balance and start giving to you, Libras. Definitely. Yeah, they've been thinking about it. They're in this energy of making that move making that step but there's something holding them back because it's in reverse so 
something holding your person back for some reason maybe because they see you and your queen of wands energy out there exploring your options probably dating talking to other people you're in a new cycle now you're not in that old cycle with this person here and now they want to jump into this new cycle with you with the full card take that leap of faith and just jump into that new cycle with you <laughs> This is what they're... Oh, what's the moon card? Let's clarify the moon. This jumped out. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah. So your person is in fear that they are going to lose out. They've invested so much energy into this connection here. If you knew it or not. This is how they feel, that they're going to lose out everything, lose out their investment here, lose out their opportunity because it's not growing between you. There's no progress here. They're in fear. This is clarified the moon card. This is their fear that they're going to lose out. So I'm going to call the Zelda Pentacles in reverse. Thank you, my angels, for the insight, for the clarity. Yeah, this is what's holding them back because, like I said, the two of wands in reverse obviously shows that they are holding back. Yes, we've got the Hierophant and the Ten of Cups in reverse. Yeah, there's been a breakup here. There's been a breakup here because Hierophant represents marriage, commitment. You know, Ten of Cups, Happy Families card is in reverse. It's in reverse. Yeah, they've lost they've they've lost their family. They've lost their family. They've lost their happiness, their emotional fulfillment. There's no growth there. Oh my gosh. Clarify the ten of cups one ten of cups in reverse. This person is just not happy. There's just no emotional fulfillment in this person's life. And they fear that that you're, you turn your, your back on them. This person is just not happy. They want to take that leap of faith towards you. Yeah. Three of swords. Three of swords. Heartbreak. It's heartbreaking, this connection here. This heartbreak, emotional pain. That's what's going on with your person. How about a hierophant? Yeah, your person is, is in a state of going through some emotional pain they've lost they feel like they've lost them um, yeah five of pentacles they feel like they've lost everything they're out in the cold they want to come out from out of the cold they're not in a in a good place emotionally this is affecting them yeah, three of pentacles in reverse. You you and your person is not on the same page. They feel like you no longer want to work with them, you know, build a future, create a future together. You're not on the same page. Yeah, there's a breakup in the partnership here with the ten of cups in reverse. It's a breakup, breaking your person's heart. Clarify the um, three of swords. Thank you, angels. Thank you for the insight and the clarity. Three of swords. Yeah, look, the sun in reverse. Knight of wands in reverse. So, yeah, there is... No light for this person. This person's in the dark. They are not happy. 
They're, they're not happy. Knight of Wands in reverse. Yeah. Some kind of player energy. This person was in a player energy and yeah it looks like you put a stop to this player energy libras yeah because the sun in reverse three of swords oh my gosh clarify queen of wands yeah oh my gosh your person libra is absolutely miserable without you I mean, they're in a state of just heartbreak and emotional pain, deep emotional pain here. Yeah. Queen of Wands. Clarify with the Eight of Cups. Strength. Four of Cups in reverse. Knight of Swords. Oh, Ace of Cups and eight, Queen of Pentacles. Okay, yeah, your focus on your on your abundance, Libras. Yeah, it's all about self love. It's all about self love. Yeah, your person is a is an energy here. Your person's in this energy. They want to come forward, rush in and communicate, but they see you in this energy, and like you just don't want nothing to do with them. Because it's got the Eight of Cups here. And the strength. You're taking the strength to leave this situation. Which is probably very emotionally unfulfilling. Just withdrawing yourself from this connection now. Yeah. This is why your person is in a state of heartbreak right now. Because you're walking away. Like you're actually... With the strength card here, you mean business, you know? This queen of wands, she means business. She's had enough. She's in this world, the world here, which represents new beginnings. Closing out old cycles and starting new cycle. With the strength card here, that is the motivation right now. She's motivated to just leave anything that no longer serves her highest good. And she's in that energy, no matter what. She's not even looking back. And this is why your person, Libra, is in this state of heartbreak. They are heartbroken over it. Absolutely heartbroken over it. This is, this is what the cards are showing. There's so much pain here. But it's like they want to come, they want to make amends because with the full card here and the six of pentacles they want to make amends they still think about you this person's very nostalgic over you they still think about you the only person's got history there's a deep connection here deep connection between you two and they're really in this energy of taking that leap of faith I come and come towards you, Libra. Clarify the two of ones. Why we got two ones in the verse? Thank you, my angels. Two of ones. Okay. High priestess, the tower, king of pentacles, the chariot, and the five of cups. I'm telling you, this person is in bits over you. No, they're really missing you. They're so sad, disappointed. They've lost out. They're heartbroken. Oh my gosh, they can't. They can't go on without you. They they want to rush in chariot. They want to rush in towards you. Yeah, King of Pentacles. You see, they want to bring you that stability. You know, long term as well. King of Pentacles represents, that's like husband material. They want to be there for you long term, give you that stability, security. Yeah, tower moment. Wow. This, whatever's happened between you guys, Libra, 
it has rocked the foundation of UT's connection. This person just weren't ready. They just probably weren't prepared and it's just shaking everything up between you two now. You being in your Queen of Wands energy, yeah, focusing on yourself, being that social butterfly, ready to explore the world, explore your options and not focus on them, has really torn down this person's, probably their ego, because we've got the Knight of Wands here in the reverse. This person was a player. Yeah. Shake things up for them. You shaking things up for them. You was guided with your intuition. Yes, your intuition led you to focus on yourself. Definitely. Wow, Libras. Major changes. You are changing the game, Libras. Wow. You go. Changing the game. This is it. This is what this person probably needed. They needed someone to um, make them check themselves before they wreck themselves, you know? <laughs> right, well, that's angels. This flew out. Release your ex, you, you see? And give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Release your ex. This time has come to clear your energy. You see, this is this is what I'm picking up. That you are going into a new cycle, Libras. You or your person. Take it how it resonates. If you're cross-watching. But your person wants you to give the relationship a chance. They want you to work on it. They don't want to let you go, Libra. I mean, you want to go into a new cycle, but this person, they want to join a new cycle with you. They don't want to start a new cycle by themselves. So they want you to give them another chance, Libra. I mean, it's up to you. But it looks like this person has to change certain ways. I mean, things can't go on as it is, clearly. And you're ready for a new chapter. Yeah, and this your person knows it. Okay, so I hope this resonates. If it does, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.